What's going on guys? Welcome back to Farming Simulator 22. It is about 9.30 on a September morning. We are on our way up here. Or actually, we're, I'm just arriving up here at the vineyard. And... I am going to come around and... Wait a minute, what is this? Is this the milk? Or is that slurry? I believe that's slurry. Milk is on this end, I believe. Yes. Yeah, because there is the Nautilus. Alright. A little stubby nose today. As you can see, we've got... Alright, I'm still working on that. But a, uh, a milk trailer came up for sale. It is not a used one. It is a new one. But we needed it, and, or I needed it, I am, I am horrible at that, I cannot get over that. Alright, so, what I'm going to do here is I'm going to pull up, and I'm going to load up the 2,156 liters of milk that I've got in the cow barn, and then I'm going to take it on down to the bakery. Also, this patch of grass here that hasn't grown in yet, I did come up and I, I did put another uh, coat of fertilizer on that. Got the heat up, I'm sorry. I did put another coat of fertilizer on that. So when that grows in, it should be nice and fertile. Nice. Uh, should have a nice yield on that. Alright, just dropped off milk. And if we look into our production page here and look at the cake. We've got all the eggs we need. All the strawberries we need. Looks like we're somewhere around two-thirds on the milk. Flowers about just a little over two thirds or one third. I am sorry, one third on the milk and just a little over one third on the flour. So all we need is sugar and butter, and we can start making cake. Take this back up to the vineyard slash ranch, cow barn, farm, dairy, whatever you want to call it. And in the last video, I mentioned something about instead of on the next Let's Play, instead of purchasing the on-map production facilities that are already placed, I'm going to be putting my own. That's with the exception of a couple. If there is a tailor shop, I'm going to be, you know, I won't put in an extra tailor shop. But the things that are there for sell points that you would get off the contracts, Things like that, like the bakery, uh, the green mill, oil mill, things like that. Those I won't be, I won't be buying those. I'll be putting my own in. Now, other production facilities like the dairy, that one in the tailor shop and the carpentry those you know those are okay to buy because those are not going to be uh, used with any of the contracts so I should be okay with that all right going to park this up I'm just going to 
parking right over here. Here we go. Getting a nice heap of manure in here. We got 3,095. I believe we can take that to the biogas plant, if I'm not mistaken. Let's take a look. Should be right around here somewhere. There it is. Manure. It says I got 6,191 liters. And yes, the biogas plant. Yep. Alright. Okay, so I've got a mystery I need you guys to help me solve. This is showing that I have 3,145 liters of manure. This shows that I'm that I've got 6,291 liters. So there's a pile of manure laying around somewhere that's like 3,000 liters. I can't figure out where it's at. I've done went around and I've checked all the silos, I've checked all the animal pens, you know, just to check. I know that the animal pens don't produce manure anymore. Not supposed to anyway. Not supposed to anyway. But I've went around here and I've checked. There's no manure laying around anywhere, and there's no way to even get in here if there was any manure in here. This is the only animals, these are the only animals that I have that would produce manure. The other animals that I have are chickens and sheep. They don't produce manure. I've checked all the silos. I walked up, I checked this one and I checked one at the South Farm. I checked the silo at the railroad on both ends. They don't even take manure. So I'm confused. Where is this other 3,000 liters? Wait a minute, I don't even need this bucket. I could fill up with this. Look at that. Whoa. There's the hole. Oh, I wish I could do something about that hole. Alright. I am going to load up all the manure that we have, or I have. I'm going to load up all the manure that I have. Oop. Failed to hit the button. And take it to the biogas plant. Eight hundred and forty six and now that is empty. Now it's showing I have zero. Very confusing. It's just showing that I have double what I actually have. It's confusing. Why would it do that? back up I 
Um, I, had, I did end up selling the other John Deere tractor that was here. He wasn't using it. Something else I need to do real quick. I need to drop this bucket off and pick up my forks. Yeah, uh, I did sell the tractor that was here, the John Deere tractor. He wasn't using it, and it was costing... It actually wasn't costing us anything, because we wasn't using it, but... I freed up some asset space here. We're no longer... using those assets slots whatever if you want to call it slots you know. okay come on click it there you go right. I'm going to pull through the workshop Because this tractor needs some TLC. Trailer two. Ooh, six thousand seven hundred. Ooh, oh, man, I need to open the door. trailer in? No. Don't want nobody stealing my tools. Shut and lock the shop. There we go. Run on down to the biogas plant, drop this off, and get some paid for it a little bit. We got $324,705 right now. We could pay off the $300,000 loan that we have with the bank for the vineyard. Or we could pay a part of that off. Or I could pay a part of that off. And then also purchase the dairy because we will I will be needing the dairy here pretty soon. need to make some butter. Can't make the butter without the dairy. Can't remember how much the dairy costs, but I believe it's somewhere around 60000 maybe 80000 Not really sure. So... Here we go. I don't know why this thing is so squirrely now. I'm gonna drop it off right down here. $293. Absolutely not worth it. But I'll do it again. Alright, I also I picked up three more contracts. One is we got some more honey. Just move that pallet real quick. We got a. So I got a cultivating contract, fertilizing contract, and a sewing contract. Yes. Here 
here. Let's go over here and pick up the cultivator. Cultivating job is for a very small field. I believe it pays out four hundred and fifty dollars. Nothing spectacular, but it, you know, it is more money. And I'll take it. Let's see, where is it at? Field eighty, and then or fertilizing field twenty-one, four hundred twenty-five dollars. And then sowing filled 60 with barley at $2,730. Pop right over this way. Alright, coming on to field 80. Which I believe it's going to be that one over there. Looks like the only one that needs cultivating. Alright, so, you know, I'm pretty sure that this cultivator needs some cult or some work on it because it's got my repair, my repair bar down. Let's see. Oh, yeah. Yeah. We're going to have to repair that here pretty soon. Let's go ahead and get this field cultivated. We got, a, we got a field we need to fertilize also. There we go saying we again. You guys ain't going to help me. Oh. I got a field to fertilize. And then I also have a field I need to get on with um, putting some seed in the ground. Some barley. And it should wrap things up for the day. Should be a quick one here. That manure situation, though, has got me really confused. Why would it show double what it actually had? Well, it's, it's just really confusing. I kind of had a feeling that it was going to do that. but I wasn't quite sure. It's not something I've seen anybody really talk about. I've seen um, a few people, they put out complete guides to cows, but that wasn't mentioned in anything that I've watched. Let's see who, uh, I don't know, Farmer Klein, we put out a video on a complete guide to cows, and also Mr. Silly P put out a video on complete guide to cows, and also Farmer Cop. He put out a video. I watched all three of those, but never mentioned in any of those you know, whether the manure heap or or whatever it is it shows in the uh, in the menu and it shows double the amount of manure that you actually have on hand so I, I don't know I'm confused on that one it might be something new or it might be something nobody's ever noticed who knows
Alright, I'm gonna get this field finished up, get paid, go on to the fertilizing, do it, get paid. Fertilizing should be really quick. Should be a very small field. And then I'll get the seed in the ground and get paid for that. So, I shall see you in just a moment. Alright, field 80 has been completed with, and uh, been paid for $56 owed to me. Alright, I went to do the fertilizing contract, but then I noticed I was just about out of fertilizer, so I went down to the store, bought a bunch of pallets, and I've just loaded it up in the trailer. I'm just going to dump it in the silo since I can store it there. And I can just load it from the silo. It cost us roughly about $18,000. So, we'll uh, just keep that in there. I'll just keep that in there. And I can load up from that. Make it a little bit more convenient. Back this back up up in here. And drop that off. Now we'll go over and get the fertilizer spreader. I missed. Try it again. Try again. Try again. There we go. We got it at that time. Yeah, so we only have about 500 liters. I hooked up and just unhooked. I was like, I need to go get some fertilizer. Alright. Open this thing up. And there we go. See, it's just that much easier. Alright. We're going to field 21 for a $425 contract. I don't even know where field 21 is. Let's see. Oh, there it is. Ah, just past the spinnery. Right up there. It's going to be filled on the right once you pull it into the drive. Alright. The seat goes up there. Alright. Up at field 21. Let's see. Should only be one pass. Oh yeah, we can get this in one pass. Right here. Somewhere's right in here. If I didn't have a little girl standing in front of me, in between me and the TV, I'd be able to see a little bit better. Alright, we're going to try for there and hope for the best. Now, I think I'm getting all of it. Can't tell because now i got two little girls standing in front of me. Blocking the TV. Contract on field 21 finished. Yeah. I know, I see you. <laughs> Alright, I'm going to collect on that. $425, only took one pass. And moving on to field 60 to plant some barley, I believe. Yep. Alright, back on the farm. I have noticed that we are full. I thought I had a animal trailer up here. I guess not. We need to sell some sheep and we need to sell some chickens. So I'm 
Okay, we're gonna have to go get our own trailer from somewhere. Uh, yep, yeah, up at the uh. Huh. You know what? Let me just check real quick and see if uh, there's an animal trailer up at the at the vineyard. Got a whole jeep. Alright. Back at the farm. Uh, and we do have a animal trailer we want to go get. Run down to the store and pick up the animal trailer. And then I'll run up and I'll take care of those. I'll sell those chickens. This will be for the chickens. I'll sell the chickens. And then I will go up to the vineyard and grab the animal trailer that we own. And then do the same for the sheep. I got a feeling we're going to be using that quite a bit. <laughs> Alright, back at the farm with the trailer that the chickens can be transported in. <laughs> you girls, be quiet. You're too loud. Alright, let's see. What chickens do we want to load? Alright. These are five months old. They are worth 21. We don't want to get rid of those. Those are $25 each. That's the ones we want to get rid of. They're nine months. Those are 18 months. Those are original chickens that we started with and these are seven months what are these nine months all right we're going to get rid of the oldest ones here and 30 of them move to trailer Looks like we have a few more left. Alright. Select. Uh. Okay. Hmm. Alright, so we cannot, and this time I am saying we because this pertains to everybody that plays. We cannot load up chickens into the animal trailers, take them to the animal dealer, and sell them. Chickens can only be sold from the chicken coop or chicken pen that they are housed in. I wish I'd known about that before. I haven't heard anybody say anything about that. But. Oh, looks like we're going to get charged a fee anyway. And I bought this trailer for absolutely no reason. That's awesome.
Well, looks like I'm going to take these chickens right back where they came from, put them back into the pen, and then sell them from there. I am a little aggravated right now. But, nobody's fault but my own for not testing it myself. Select, 30, move to husbandry. Oh yeah? Alright. Nope, we don't want to go there. We want to go this one. These are five months, two months, nine months, three months, eighteen months. Right here. These. I believe we have fifty. Yes, fifty. And we're going to sell all fifty. Alright, so that's only going to be a $5 fee, so that's not too bad. We'll do that. I'm going to sell it for $1,245. Thank you. Let me just look. Alright, here we go. Alright, so these are about to... Um, reproduce next month. These are not. These are about halfway through their cycle, and these are just starting. What are these? Seven months and a hundred of these. Okay. Where's the nine month? Right there. Alright, so the nine month and the seven month. Looks like they're on the same cycle as what gave us the 100 chickens here. So, I think I'm going to sell these after they reproduce again. Alright. That's what's going to happen. And we need to come down to the sheep pens and sell off some sheep. <sighs> hmm. Still highly disappointed. with this trailer and not being able to load up chickens and sell the chickens. I'd love to take these chickens down to KFC and drop them off and get some money but you know I don't think Giants is going to allow that. Well that's ours now. After that little discovery, I don't even want it now. Because I've got two chicken coops. They both have chickens in them. I don't think I'm going to be buying a, th a third chicken coop. Almost missed that turn. Alright, on to the venue.
On the way to the vineyard, I just now noticed that our helper down there on foot 60 is done planting the barley, and we should be able to collect on the on the contract. So let's just do that once we make this turn. There it is. Yep, let's collect. And we're going to get past because we wasn't paying attention. And yep, there we go. Whew, that was close. Alright. Oh, it looks like this tractor needs some TLC now, too. Alright. We're going to hook up to the the uh, the cattle trailer right there. And. We'll go load up some sheep. This one you can't open the top on. But, no need. Alright, see you there. God, I just love the look of this tractor. Alright. Alright, here we go. We want these right here. These are 18 months old. These are 5 months and these are a month. So we want these. And there are 10. We'll move those to the trailer. Let's make a stop at this one. And I'm going to load up these. I think we can only hold three. Yep. Alright, we got a full load. We'll come back to the other seven. Sell this load of sheep. Let's see what that brings us to money wise. Hopefully, that will cover the cost of the uh, um, chicken trailer that we bought that is absolutely pointless to have now. That was eighteen thousand dollars, and I'm going. Or was it eighteen thousand? I believe it was. So it's sixteen thousand base, and I changed the wheels, and I also changed the color of it, so that raised the price of it a little bit. So yeah, I think it was like eighteen thousand, maybe eighteen thousand five hundred. Who knows? Let's see how much I can make off of these sheep. And then we'll go back and we're going to end up selling the other seven sheep. And then we'll sell the, the chicken trailer because it's absolutely pointless now. Since you cannot unload them at this place. Seven thousand and one hundred and fifty. We'll sell those. And let's go on back, load up the other seven. Let's see how close that gets us to that eighteen thousand five hundred. And then we're gonna sell that little cattle trailer and hopefully recoup the money. Got the last seven loaded up. Made it out. I'm going to go to the animal dealer. And I've actually changed my mind here just a little bit. Instead of trying to take 
and recoup the money for the animal trailer that we bought, the, the chicken trailer. I've actually decided that I thought, hey, this sounds like a good idea. We sell the sheep. We sold some chickens. So we sell the sheep. And whatever we make off the sheep, we'll buy more cows. So we've already made 7150 off of the first load of sheep. Whatever we make off of this, plus the 7150 we'll buy that much in cows. Because we, we don't really need sheep a whole lot, really. We have a steady flow of, of wool coming in already. I mean, we're really not keeping up with ourselves here with the fabric. I don't know why I just turned that on. So, $11,000 worth of sheep. Alright. Let's buy some more cows. First, let's just take a look. And we have, we've got Holsteins. Alright. So let's buy some more Holsteins. We'll buy six more. And that'll be, you know, a thousand seven hundred. Yeah. Bye. Okay. There we go. We'll just do that and call it even. And then we're going to take the... Alright, we'll call that even. And then I'm going to grab the little chicken trailer. Sell it because... I'm just disgusted by it now. Super excited that we can actually transport chickens. But we can only transport chickens from the animal dealer. To the chicken pen. I don't even know if we can do that. I know we can transfer chickens from one pen to the other, but can we even pick them up from the animal dealer? I don't. I don't know if we can. I know we can't drop them off at the animal dealer to sell, and that's what I needed it for. And now that I can't do that, it's pointless to have, and it's, and it's a really cheap fee. It's only $5 for 50 chickens. I, I can eat that. So yeah. I've been begging and begging and begging giants for the last five years for the ability, the ability to transport chickens then a modder has graciously granted us that ability and now I'm just I'm over it already I'm disgusted it's awesome it's awesome what he's done though I'm not knocking anything that he has done it's just it's probably beyond his capabilities to be able to allow to sell to the animal dealer from the chicken trailer so not knocking anything that they have done absolutely not I appreciate every single thing that they do all right see you back at the, at the dairy at the vineyard all right got our six new Holsteins here in our lovely cow barn. All twelve are here. Got one there, one there. This makes four, five, six, seven, eight, 
9, 10, 11, and missing one. Hmm. We got 12. It says right there on the screen. Alright. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Seven. Eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. I just can't count. Okay. All right. Now we just got. Oh, looks like we need. We need. We need to feed these cows. Not that far off. So, where'd I leave my tractor? I hear it. Yep, there it is. Alright. Go and hook up to the feed trailer. I believe there's still feed left in it. That was horrible. Alright. Total mix ration. Still got 1,857. So we're gonna drop that off, and I think I'm going the wrong way. Took every single bit of that. Alright, I'm gonna make some more. I'm gonna make some more and then I will see you when I'm done making some more. Alright, back at it again. Got a full 22,000 liters. I went down to the store and picked up some mineral feed. Also put in here. I put the whole pallet in first. And then mixed up some total mix ration. There we go. We are completely full. It says 33,750 liters of feed is in. I don't know why it says I got 3,742 liters of hay in there. That's weird. Because it didn't show that. It didn't show that before I just put this in. This is total mix ration. Why is it pumping it out as hay? Oh, it's another one of them. Another one of them deals. says forage. Why is it forage? And look, it's coming out as hay. See, the forage is empty. No, Thirty-four thousand six hundred sixteen. <laughs> now the hay says forty-one thousand two hundred sixty. Oh, I give up. I 
I don't. So many bugs. I already know what I'm going to name the episode. Complete clucking failure and an utter disappointment. Mm -hmm. Just so aggravated right now. And that is going to be it for today. I hope you guys enjoyed it. It's been a learning experience. If you have, go ahead and hit that like button. Hit the subscribe button while you're at it if you haven't. Set your notifications to all. Hit me up on Discord and Facebook. And I hope you have a great day. Later, guys.